Hello, hello everybody, DTX720 here, and welcome to Super Mario 35, Super Mario Bros. 35. This game is super fun and super addicting, I've played it a lot, hell of a lot, I love this game. The, the, the simplest thing I could just say is addicting, and I've gotten so close many, 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 many occasions to winning, but I have only ever gotten to second place a couple of times, I have not been able to defeat, defeat the king in my way. Whoever may that be. Bikuaz. It gets crazy when you're toward the end. Especially when when you start jacking up and the pressure kicks in. It's kind of like Tetris 99. So in this game you can start off with uh, stuff like a fire flower, a star, or a big mushroom. And I've played this a lot so I have a lot of coins saved up. So I usually always start with this fire flower because it helps me get through places quick. My strategy is try to get as many easy coins and time as possible. Like, you'll see me go through world one. You'll see me go through the couple worlds that I know really fucking well, which is most of the game. But I'll go through them very fast. And I'll go through them pretty much the same way every time, except for when I'm in dire chaos and in need of help. Like here, usually when this place gets chaotic, I usually skip this block, but since it's early and we're not being attacked that heavily, we can easily snatch up some free coinage. Starmen are like the best thing ever. When you are playing this game, I tell you. We have also that random box. For anybody who hasn't played Mario 35, who isn't a Nintendo Switch Online member, I feel like it's worth Nintendo Switch Online by itself, and it sucks that I believe it's only for a limited time. I believe it's only a limited time thing. So that really sucks. Like, why would they make it a limited time thing? It should be like Tetris 99. It should just be in perpetuity. I can't say that word, but it should just be a forever thing because this game is so fun and addicting, and I can't imagine my life without it. But this game plays exactly like the original Mario Bros, but as you can see right here, it's like the shortcuts change every time. There's a lot of people attacking you, there's a lot of garbage. You get sent to random levels, unless you find a shortcut like that and you pick a level. You have this box at the top, this mystery box that says 20 coins, and up on top are my coins and the time. I don't know why I just used my coins there. Hey, look at that. I got back my flower that I just lost. Um, we want people to attack us because we're running short on time. Come on, attack me. I want time. Damn it. Okay, okay. We're gonna have to run through Bowser. Oh, God! Damn it, we lost our flower and shit. Alright, well, we got through Bowser. Okay, we got... Oh, we got... I got a lot of people attacking me now. Oh, God. Don't screw up! How? Of course, when I'm recording, that's when I suck the worst at this damn game. All right, we're going right into another one. We are not waiting very long. Right there on that menu, I assume, I don't know what, I don't know why you choose a stage, but I assume it like lets you, um, it throws whatever stages you want to throw into the mix. So I guess if everybody votes on a stage, your stage will get in thrown in there somewhere. So I wonder what would happen if everybody just voted World 1-1. Would it only be World 1-1? Kind of weird. Doesn't really tell you much, but because we keep going. I've been watching a lot of Markiplier and Unis Honest. Rest in peace, Unis Honest. Uh, uh, your channel, your channel is amazing. I just have to say that. If anybody wasn't able to witness Unis Honest, you really missed out. I can't tell you to go catch up on it because it's gonna be gone in like two days. Maybe even a day, or it might already be gone, depending on whenever I upload this video. But Unis Honest was awesome. Markiplier and Kink Crank Gameplays. Markiplier and Ethan. Mark and Ethan. I said Kink Gameplays. Crank Gameplays. They're still around. They're not dead, but their channel and their Unis Honest cells will be dead. Makes me very sad. I'm not trying to talk about Unis Honest in this Mark in this Mark in this Mario 
video of Mario 35, but I'll be honest, I'm just talking about random shit because I gotta keep my mind occupied while playing this so that I am not, one, silent and boring, you guys, and two, I don't want to focus too much. I gotta stay in the flow, you know what I mean? I gotta stay on the, on the rhythm that I have while playing this. I've been able to get to second place. And that is about damn it. That is it. <laughs> it's interesting playing this game also. It's like helping me perfect like speedrunning Mario. Even though I'm not at all like 0% a professional speedrunner whatsoever. But it's pretty fun uh, getting through these Mario levels like very fast and cautiously. What I really like to do is, I like this right now, what's going on, this, um, oh hell yeah, this is gonna be chaos, let's get some Lakitu's up in here. Oh damn, people are already sending me their own Lakitu's. Okay, give me a second, Lakitu's, stop throwing spinies. Okay, they threw spinies right at my head. We're gonna send all that to someone who deserves it. No! Okay, come on, give me another one. I don't want to make any risky moves here. Okay, cool. So I I truly believe that having a Fire Flower for the majority of the time in this is literally your best bet. You don't want to take any risks that you don't have to take. Oh my god. Oh my god. Here's this, is where, this is where I die. Whew! I don't know how I lived that. Okay, don't take any risks. Don't take any risks. Give me a Fire Flower. Thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Oh god, 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 okay. We're out of We're out of Yes, that was lovely. Okay, 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 okay. No! Oh no, 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 god damn it. Of course, when I am recording, of course, when I am recording is gonna be when I suck the worst. Of course. That's just how life works, man. It just got to fuck you over. It just got to stick a knife in your neck and it just got to twist it right when you're doing a recording session. Mario 35 got to just stab you in the eye with one of those stars, throw a spiny up your ass and call you Charlie. What's my dog's name? Um... Anyways, let's take deep breaths and let's run fast, even though we're not Sonic the Hedgehog at all. So if you're really good at the original Mario, you should be good at Mario 35. The only thing is, if you're good under pressure. Pressure, pushing down on me, no one asked for. No, thank you. So this is usually my strategy. You'll see I have the exact same strategy on World 1-1. Like every single run through, I have the exact same strategy. Very rarely will I differ from that. Like, you know, the tube that takes you all the way through the level. Very rarely I'll do that. Maybe, maybe that's a smart idea when you're in those higher points. I have a lot of people attacking me, which can be good, but it also can be really bad right now. I think it's actually a smart idea to have a lot of people after you at this stage. Because if I'm able to recover and kill everything they send at me, it's going to send a hell of a lot more back at them. That's at least been my mindset. Most of the time, I will get lucky and get a star right when a bunch of chaos happens. And that's like the best thing you can ask for. You also just want to get whatever coins you can because that coins, those coins, they will freaking help you with the coin box. They will fucking help you. And you also want to, you also kind of want things to come after you because Sometimes time is a problem too. Like this game has a lot of factors. That was unnecessary risk that I should not have taken. I don't know why I did, but I'm not thinking clearly because I haven't played this whilst talking. Okay, 
this world 1-1 is a lot of simple and easy coinage. And it's like a very safe zone. Like, I don't think I've ever really died. Unless I did just early on this video and I already forgot, but it's very hard to die on world 1-1. Especially if you have a multitude of Mario experience, like somebody who's grown up playing the game. And, and granted, I wasn't even born in the 80s. I was born in the late, late 90s, but I still grew up playing this because the first console I ever played was the NES, and then right after that was the Genesis. So I grew up on Mario and Sonic, even though a lot of people, people my age being only 21, born in 99, they didn't grow up with that stuff. They grew up with maybe an N64, maybe a GameCube, maybe a Wii. But a lot of people in my generation, it's all 360s, PS3s, you know? <laughs> but I've always been a gamer gamer at heart. I've, I've, I've... The first console, every console that I've gotten to myself, they've all been new and they, I mean, they've all been older consoles and it's been by choice. It was only like when I've bought my own consoles that they've been brand new pretty much. Except for when you talk about like handhelds like the 3DS. But my first personal home console that I got myself that was bought for me was like way out of date at that point. The 360, the Wii, and the um, PS3 were already out at that point. But um, when I was a little bit younger, I grew up playing the, the GameCube. Um, that was the one that I had at my house anyways, and I also had an NES at my house that owned, that belonged to my grandmother, because she liked playing Mario, and it's like the only thing that my grandmother can play is this, because it's pretty simple. The only person I've ever met that cannot play Super Mario Bros, at least a little bit, is my aunt, and she's just a lame-ass, she's one of those aunts that's like... The video games are boring, uh, or something like that, I don't know. Old, you know, old lady nonsense, like video games are, you know, wasted time. But I don't believe it. One of the ones I like to avoid the most, one of the levels I like to avoid the most in this game is this level, World 3-3. Now we're back on 1-1-1! One, 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 one. So if you know Mario physics really well, play Mario 35 and see how freaking good you do. I can see that that guy over there is on the water level right now. So that means we're gonna get some squids coming our way if he decides to attack us. Oh, another guy's on the water level. Ooh, and he's targeting us. <coughs> Excuse me. I got something caught in my throat. Oh god, I need some water. I don't know what's caught in my throat, but I got something caught in my throat. I need water. I'm dying. Fish out of water. Ah, oh, here we go. Let's send some squids. Some bloopers! We need to get some bloopers. I have a lot of coins, but getting more won't hurt. Oh, jeez. I hate wayward bloopers. Stay in your pattern! No, stay in your pattern! No, stay in your pattern! Okay, fuck, okay. Keep going, keep going, move, 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 move. Oh, yes! Pow was good. Yes, pow is good. Pow is very good. Pow again. Oh, star's good too. Go ahead, you guys can touch me. All you squads, you wanna touch? Ooh, Bowser, you wanna touch me? Oh yes, you go ahead. Oh, fishies, yes. We wanna send all that garbage, that perfect, beautiful garbage, we wanna send it all toward him. Yes, and we got our fire flower back, that is awesome. That works perfectly to our detriment. But now, how many squids are gonna be sent back to us? That one guy on the left died. There's only one left on the left. That's funny. There's only one left on the left. See what I did there? I don't know if you guys understand comedy or anything, but that was a golden joke. Get these squads out of here. Squads. 
Squads! Oh, Jesus. Some tons of squads. You're wearing a squid hat, baby. Okay, those squids weren't that much of a problem. Oh, we have a bozer coming up. Okay. There's no need to panic. The music's going faster, but don't let it Tetris 99 ya. Alright, there we go. Haha, -ha, take out that Bowser, take out all these good enemies. I want some hammer bros up in here. Yes. Send all of them. Oh, and all those fish. Oh, and then we're gonna have some Bowsers of our own here. Whoa! Hella Bowser. Oh, easy to kill Bowsers. Look, they're just down here waiting for the pickings. Oh. Waiting for the fucking pickings. Okay. I wanna be very careful. No unnecessary movements. Okay, fuck. Okay, fuck. Step back. Oh, yeah, that's good. That's good. Let's just use it to our advantage. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Go, get to Bowser. Get to Bowser, 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 get to Bowser. Yes! Yes! Yes, baby! Yuck. <laughs> okay, I want to get this fire flower, though. Okay, let's run through. Let's run through. Should I even take the risk? Oh, I did. Okay, nobody's really targeting me. So this, oh no, okay, we got this one guy targeting. Oh, we're in the final three, I didn't notice. I shouldn't have noticed, I shouldn't have even looked. I don't know why I looked at that. Now it's just gonna give me more pressure. Okay, Jesus Christ, look at all those Bowsers. Oh, Jesus Christ, yes, send them all. Send them all, send them all. Send them all back to him, send them all back to him. Kill that motherfucker. Oh, he's on the, he's on the bird bridge. The bird bridge. He's on fucking, oh God. Kill the Bowser. Okay, kill the other Bowser. Kill the other Bowser. No! Oh, fuck. Run past him. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh no. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ, please. Oh God. Thank you. Oh God. Okay, okay, let's just go. Let's just go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Get to Bowser, get to Bowser. Yes! Yes. Yes. Go. No. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. This is not good. This is not good. No. Give me. No! No! Oh god, no! Oh god, no. Oh. Oh god, no. Oh. No. Jesus Christ. Oh fuck. <laughs> we were in the final four. Oh, fuck. <laughs> God damn it. The urge of me having to pee ruined it, but we're gonna play another game while I hold my bladder. Oh my goodness. Why? Why does nobody love me? I know we care about Fid the Sloth. 3, 2, 1. That was heartbreaking. God, when you get so freaking close and you're doing so damn good, it makes me so upset. Go ahead, bring them all. Bring them all. Come on. Free time or free coinage. These right here, these killers. Me killing these boombers. They are the free time. Know your Mario secrets, and you will go far in Mario 35. I know that. 
and also if you have just fast Mario movements. I was doing pretty damn good. I don't want to toot my own horn, but uh, I just can't believe that I freaking that happened, man. That fish literally was out to get me. Freaking ice JJ fish. Baby, come get me. Oh, look, the fish is back for revenge. I seen him. Somebody's already with fishies. I can't believe that. Okay, the way has been cleared. Whoa! Okay, well, it didn't matter. Take that, bozer. Clear the way, please. Clear the area. Sorry, I got silent for a second. I was, I was concentrating. Concentration is key. We got a couple people after us. Okay, but we're fine. Oh, Bozer. Hell yeah. Send that Bozer on over. Red Rover, Red Rover. Send the Bozer on over. Give me a star. Okay, flower, let's be cautious. No unnecessary risks. Oh god, we're gonna get hit. Okay, I thought for sure we were gonna get hit. There we go. Look, that's the same motherfucker. That's the same fucking guy. He's out for vengeance. Okay, this is good. Okay. Okay, let's try to get through this quick. I feel like this level is like just terrible. Okay. All right, let's go, let's go, let's fucking go. Let's go, I'm done, I'm done. Ah, you bastards. All right, I'm done, I'm done. Fuck that fish. That fish could kiss my ass. Pow, there we go, I call that. I seen a bozer coming over. Somebody Red Rover to Bozer on over. Red Rover, Red Rover, send the Bozer on over. Look, there he is. There's the Bozer. And also, so, I, I didn't mention this either, but um, this line down here tells you when things are coming. Yeah, this is a good area to fight a Bozer. So we're fine. Alright, we're in the final five. Final four now. Let's just hope that these guys are the ones that make mistakes. But usually they're not. If they make it this far, they're not mistake makers. Nobody's after me either. I want somebody after me. Because otherwise, if I don't have enemies, I'm going to run out of time. And I don't want to run out of time. Running out of time is the worst thing that can happen. Okay, I got somebody after me. Let's keep him after me. This is 2-4. Okay, I don't want it to be the one of the castles that I do not know the way. You do not know the way. Because there are castles that you have to know the... Whoa! Okay. Oh, okay, I hate this. I hate these freaking escalators things. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. Eee! Oh, I wanted those free coins. Okay, wait. Patience. No unnecessary risks, like I said. Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. Ah, oh, he took my flower. Send me to somewhere good, please. No. Please, God, no. Give me a star. Give me a star. Try again. No. Please, God, no. Not again. Not again, please. Oh, yeah, star. A star. Yes. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Please. Okay, another star. That's good. That's good, I like. I like. I like. Give me another something good. 
Okay, that wasn't something I wanted. Oh, Jesus, I'm gonna die. Okay, please keep me alive. Please, Lord Jesus Christ, love. Okay, okay. Okay, please send me back to 1-1. Please send me back to 1-1. Jesus, no. Oh, God! Okay. I almost missed that jump. Okay. Let's be very cautious. Oh, there's a Bowser coming up. Alright, fuck. Run through, run through, run through, run through. I'm dead, I'm dead. Oh! Oh, damn it! God damn it! <sighs> Alright, guys. In the next episode, our quest continues. Have a wonderful night. Thanks for chatting with me.